Oh my god, 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 oh my god. We're four months into the year, and finally, finally, we have some news. Now we've had news during this year, obviously, it'd be kind of ridiculous if we had zero bits of information. We've had a few trailers and games revealed, but they've been like, not that crazy. The news this year has been kind of light. It's been like, it's been diet news compared to things that we were getting like last year and the year before. Today though, we finally have our first major piece of Sonic the Hedgehog news to break this year, and it is something that's very exciting and something that I've been waiting for for a very, very long time. It's official guys, we are getting the Knuckles series, it's been a long wait, we've been waiting for some news on this thing for a long time, but we finally have an announcement that is coming out of Variety, and also we have a tweet from director Jeff Fowler about the series, so let's just dive into all of this, this is all very exciting. I. Can't wait, let's dive into this right now. Sonic the Hedgehog spin-off series Knuckles at Paramount Plus sets cast including Adam Pally, Tika Sumter. If you guys don't know, Adam Pally plays Wade, uh, Tom's like sidekick or just fellow cop in Green Hills, and Tika Sumter is Tom's wife in the movies. She plays Maddie, so those are interesting two characters to include in the show. And I'm assuming the show is just going to be called Knuckles, not Knuckles the Echidna or Knuckles the Sonic series, just Knuckles. So I think that works very good. The live action Knuckles series starring Idris Elba at Paramount Plus has assembled its cast. The show was first announced in February 2022. That is very true, and we've heard nothing since. In addition to Elba reprising the role of Knuckles from Sonic the Hedgehog 2, Variety has learned that Adam Pally Happy Endings, The Mindy Project, is set to star in the series once again playing the role of Wade Whipple from the film franchise. I don't even know his last name. The film takes place between the events of Sonic the Hedgehog 2 and Sonic the Hedgehog 3, which is slated to hit theaters December 20th of 2024. In the hit series, Knuckles agrees to train Wade as his protege in and teach him the ways of the Echidna Warrior, per the official logline. Eddie Patterson, The Righteous Gemstones, Julian Barrett, uh, Mindhorn, and Scott Muscutty, Don't Look Up, and uh, Ellie Taylor from Ted Lasso will recur in the series. Now, if you guys don't know, Muscutty is actually Kid Cudi, uh, who not only did the ending song to Sonic 2, or like the main song, I don't know what you call it, but he's also just freaking Kid Cudi. Uh, and he's done a few projects, so that's very cool. Roy McCain, the Game of Thrones, will guest star, as will Tika Sumter reprising the role of Maddie from the films. Additional casting will be announced at a later date, so got some names in there, that's very cool. Production on the series is now underway in London. John Winnington, who worked on the screenplay for Sonic the Drug 2, wrote the pilot for Knuckles and serves as head writer and executive producer on the series. Brian Schachter uh, and James uh, Majeski are also writers. Jeff Fowler, who directed both Sonic the Hedgehog films, will direct the pilot episode and executive produce the series. Neil H. Morris and Toby Asher of Original Film and Toru Nukara, <laughs> all members of the film's creative team, serve as executive producers as does Elba. Jed Wright, Brandon Trost, uh, Jorma Tacone, and Carol Banker are also directing episodes. Paramount Pictures and Sega of America produce. Sonic the Hedgehog was released in theaters in February 2020, and the sequel debuting in April 2022. In total, the two films have earned over $405 million at the global box office. I believe it's more than that, it's like $700 million, but yeah. Or maybe they're just talking about profit, I don't know, but yeah. That is uh, very, very cool. That is the article. Very, very exciting! It is crazy, especially when I was reading the, the opening part saying that when the f show was first announced back in February of 2022, because now we're in April of 2023, and this is genuinely the first time we've like actually like heard official news on the series since that date, which is just insanity. It's crazy that it's taken that long, but um, I'm just happy that we're get still getting the show. And that uh, it should be coming out this year, potentially, maybe. We'll have to wait and see. It is a mini series, so it's not like it's going to take too long to film, I don't believe. And it doesn't sound like the plot is going to be anything super high maintenance or super action focused. It's going to be about Knuckles training Wade to be an Echidna warrior. From the sounds of it, it doesn't sound like too many other characters are going to get involved, with really the only other returning cast members being Adam Pally and Tika Sumter. No James Marsden, and also no mention of other voice actors or characters like Sonic or Tails, aka 
uh, Ben Schwartz or Colleen O'Shaughnessy or somebody like that, or if they choose to get the Tales replacement voice actors, I don't know. But before we just like go fully bonkers and just talk about everything, uh, there is a tweet from Jeff Fowler that he put out uh, with the hashtag Knuckles and a photo of a clapperboard with the Knuckles show logo on it and showing director Jeff Fowler and camera Brandon Trost. On top of it is probably what you all are looking at, and that is a hat that iconically is worn by Knuckles in the Sonic the Hedgehog OVA, and that is just so cool wow is he actually gonna wear it in the show i think people would be kind of disappointed if he doesn't so like that, that'd be kind of weird if they made that prop and it wasn't in the show i i'm very excited to see if knuckles is going to be wearing that hat now from this point on that'd be so cool but yeah guys it's happening it's legit it's a real thing it is coming very soon there was no mention of a release date which i do think is very interesting uh, they could have said like later 2023 they could have said like an estimated time frame but they chose not to give one which is okay i'm gonna stick by them uh filming right now and it being a mini series and not being anything too high maintenance like we said earlier so maybe it can reach its uh release date of by the end of this year giving us like around a year break between sonic movie projects which works great at least one project a year i'm not complaining about i'm very excited for it it sounds very fun it sounds very funny i think it's definitely going to be more of a comedy series i'm assuming the, the show's about him training wade like the was a really comedic relief character in the movies i i, I, just, I don't know how serious we're gonna get with it we'll see what happens but I, nonetheless i am very excited to see like how this is going to turn out and everything like that i've been hearing a lot about this show if you guys have been hearing me talking about news coming soon this was the news i was talking about i've had a lot of people reach out to me via like email and dms and people saying that news is coming soon on it some people who've been working on the show etc uh, etc et i'm not going to air anybody out so many people have been coming to me be like dude the show's not canceled don't worry so i've just been waiting for this news to drop and it's finally dropped i'm so excited i believe the show is filming in london right now somewhere in like pinewood studios like that how much of the set we'll be able to see if we'll see any set photos leaks etc i have no clue i hope we do so we could cover more of it but of course if we see anything in relation to this show if we get any more information any little drop any anything i will of course report on it because the sonic movie universe is definitely my favorite thing to talk about it's just so interesting and i think so many of you guys care so much about it and I'm just so so excited for it. Yeah guys, that was it. That was the that was the announcement. What do you guys think about the Knuckles show officially being confirmed and announced with a bunch of new info, including a first look at Knuckles' hat? We got the clapperboard. Also, not just that, but we have official synopsis, cast. We have uh, producers and writers confirmed for the show. Are you excited for it? Are you liking what you're hearing? Or are you not liking what you're hearing? Let me know in the comment section down below. I'd love to know what you guys have to say. Feel free to follow me on social media. Links to my Twitter and Instagram, which are super low. You can follow those buttons. Click my life feature on to end all things Sonic the Hedgehog. But most importantly, if you're not subscribed, make sure you're subscribed. This is the number one station on YouTube for all things Sonic. Whether it's video games, TV shows, movies, comic books, merchandise, and more, we talk about it all. Now that this news is officially out there, I think things are going to start ramping up in terms of news for this in terms of leaks in terms of announcements i'm very excited to see where this goes what does this mean for sonic movie 3's filming not sure i think that might push it back a little bit i think we might have that movie start filming towards the end of this year rather than like summertime like i predicted and also the writers of the sonic movies not being involved in this show is also very interesting they must just be focusing all their efforts on three right now which is perfectly understandable and i'm very excited for that but yeah guys i love all you so much there's plenty of news still on the way i definitely know and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out I know what you want right now, I know what you want right now You should be proud of it, you should be proud of it